scientists just sequenced the oldest modern human genome ever. And they actually got quite a few. These were around 45,000 years old and they came from Czechia and Germany. Based on the phenotypes from the highest coverage genome, this is what that individual from Czechia around 45,000 years ago would have looked like. DNA also suggested the population was at most a few hundred individuals who may have been spread over a large territory and that they have no modern day descendants. This lineage died out. The individuals did have Neanderthal admixture and it is the same Neanderthal admixture that we find in all modern day populations that descend from these groups that left Africa around 50,000 years ago. And let's talk about that real quick actually because that is more complex than it seems when I say it that way because the evidence does suggest that we left this area around 55,000 years ago meeting up with Neanderthals shortly after but there also is evidence of a really long standstill period here right here it says 82 to 55,000 years ago where populations made it out of Africa but just didn't really expand beyond this area. And also, if you're like, that, this is only a 45,000 year old genome, I know you've talked about older human genomes than that. I have, just not our species, not modern humans. Neanderthals, yeah. Denisovans, yeah. I just talked about this one earlier this year, a 200,000 year old Denisovan genome. But it's important to remember that these colder areas, they preserve DNA a lot better than Africa, which is why we don't really have those high coverage genomes from our own species. Yet, the scientists continue finding new ways to extract DNA, different parts of the bone that are more likely to hold DNA. I'm not giving up. I think eventually we'll start figuring it out. 